Yeah, whatever you do, just don't get the shit, the bird shit. Wait, did it? No, don't get it though. Don't no, get no, that. No, don't get it though. Don't get it. It's fucking. Okay. What's going? No, 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 no. Stop with the bird shit, bro. Leave it alone. Leave it alone. We're good. What's going on, guys? Bradley Martin here today. Just can we can we focus? Okay, go. Okay, okay. Today I'm gonna give you guys uh, upper back routine. Big upper back routine. Traps. You know the beast muscles. The muscles that like everyone's like, oh, these are the muscles. These are the ones. These are the ones that are the ones that make you look the best. Right? That's what they say. I know that's what they exactly say. Exactly like that. Exactly word for word. Yeah. Quote me. Um, man. So this is the upper back routine. And I have to say, probably one of my more favorite routines because it's a blend of like everything. It's a blend of, um, you know, contraction. It's a blend of like just moving the weight. Uh, anyway, it started with the lap pull downs. And I didn't do this in a typical fashion. I did it, like normally you guys do lap pull downs and you'll think about like pulling with your elbows like down, keep your chest up, pull your elbows down. I'm not doing it that way. The way that I'm doing it here is I'm thinking about pulling my elbows back, all right? So I'm thinking about grabbing the bar, keep my chest up and I'm pulling my elbows back and trying to pull the bar towards like my nose or like my teeth, like I'm trying to knock my teeth out. But don't knock your teeth out because if you did it, would you look like someone from like, you know, one of those weird TV shows when they live in trailer parks anyways. It's a long story. So pull the elbows back, back and like together, back and together, not down and together. Anyways, I did this four sets, um, 12 to 15 reps, increasing the weight each set. Um, next exercise I moved to a uh, chest supported high row. Um, high and wide is what you can think about. Loosen your hands, don't grab really hard with your hand, otherwise you bring too much your front delt. We're trying to work the upper back, traps, scapula. Um, anyways, that exercise I did, same thing, four sets, closer to 15 reps. Um, and take a, like a low rest, try and move through these quickly, um, cause we're getting ready for a funner, one of my favorite movements. Um, <coughs> it's not this next one, but the next one is the face pulls. Face pulls is something that's like a staple in most of my back workouts, whether it be for like strength or aesthetic or whatever, it's a staple and I do it all the time. Um, just cause it helps you as well, as you guys know for the bench for setting your back up. It just makes everything feel sturdy, everything feels safe. And uh, for this variation of face pull, I put two like uh, D handles. You guys might have D handles or um, you know, uh, the cloth ones. Is that what they were? Handles? Anyways, they're handles and put two of them on there and I'm thinking about pulling with my elbows back and pulling with my hands apart. So back and apart. You guys seen this video, I'm going back and apart. And kind of like keep your hands loose. So back and apart, okay? Um, that same thing is higher reps, lower weight. I'm short to like towards like 20 reps. Um, again, four sets. Uh, and that one has like a little bit of a longer rest, probably like a minute rest in between um, because I'm taking more rest before the bigger exercise, which is one of my favorite exercises for traps, for upper back, for everything, for grip strength, for everything. Um, the shrugs. So typical barbell shrugs. I like to make sure when I'm doing heavy weight that I keep the weight all the way against my body. Um, as I'm warming up, I'll, you'll see I'll kind of tend to like grab the weight and lean a little bit forward, keep my chest upright, and I'll pull kind of like up and over. But as the weight gets heavier and heavier, my, my weight is like stuck back, pinned back on my heels, my glutes are nice and tight. Remember that, when you're doing heavy weight, your glutes have to be tight. If your butt's relaxed, you're putting your lower back in like a really fucked up position to get injured so that you'll be like, you gotta hurt yourself. You don't wanna hurt yourself, that's not the point of this. Try to get better, not worse. Anyway, so keep your glutes nice and tight, just like pin yourself to the floor, keep your chest up, glutes are still tight. And all you're thinking about is like sliding the barbell against your body, straight up and down, keeping your arms long as possible. So don't, don't bend like this, don't try to like lift with your biceps, because there's a lot of tension, a lot of pressure being placed on your arms, on your upper back. Um, hands out one of my favorite exercises. Uh, yeah, because lift heavy shit, why not, right? Once you have something to add, you said you wanted me to, to stop for a second then. Did you want to add something to this? You forgot? Yeah. yeah. When? Earlier. Like turn around so you can see from the back. From the back? Yeah. When you're doing the face balls, like turn around so you can see from the back. Yeah. No, but you want to add something to, the, to this portion of it. We have one more exercise. I'm fucking with you, bro. <laughs> fucking speak, bro. <laughs> People tell me why Bradley is such a dick. Yo, I'm what? I'm not a dick. You're I'm a not, dick. I'm we not don't like you. No, we don't like you on my channel. Who doesn't like me? Everybody, comment below. Brad vs. Nadim. Someone make a comment. Brad vs. Nadim. If it Watch gets more. Watch who be fucked up if Nadim gets more. 
Thumbs the demo, up. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. For real. Don't, don't, guys. Guys, for real. Guys. Shut the fuck up, bro. Guys, don't do this. Guys. Don't do this. Don't do it. Anyways. So, thumbs down is for Nadim. Thumbs up is for Brad. Which one should I do? Guys. No, no, no. Do mine for sure. Why are you getting him called the police, bro? I don't know. Chill. Anyways, last exercise. This was actually Nadim's idea, so blame him for this. It felt good, though. Um, a plate upright row, and I just did this as a burnout. I did four sets, so all these exercises have been four sets. This one, I didn't count any reps, I just went until I couldn't. Um, and what you guys can do, mess with your hand placement. So if you're holding it like really high on the top and it feels kind of uncomfortable. How much did you shrug? How much did I shrug? Did you get the whole thing? Eight, was it 855? 855. Yeah, so I shrug 855 in the video. <laughs> How many reps was that? Those some good reps too. That was a lot of reps. Was it to the good music? Yeah. Can we put the music in there for a second? I'll leave it in. Okay, cool. Anyways, so when you guys are doing these, these plate rows, high rows, mess with your hand placement on the plate. So like, you don't have to be like all the way into the side if it's uncomfortable when you're coming up. Pull your hands a little bit further out so you're like wider on the plate. Same thing. And now you gotta think about is pulling your elbows above, above your hands, okay? Um, anyways, that was it. Burnout on those. I hope you guys like the workout. I know I did. I actually had a great workout for, for once, I think. Most of the times I film these videos, I'm like, <clears throat> I'm going on film and I don't really get like a solid solid workout because I'm trying to make sure that I'm getting enough uh, Like points or the right angles and the right stuff for you guys that you guys get the most out of it But today was actually a really dope workout. I had a good time um, I put, I'm gonna put this clip on my Instagram pretty soon. So if you can, actually seen the thing. I've seen it. Who cares? Yeah. Fuck Instagram. YouTube for life. We'll follow you on Instagram. But follow me on Instagram. If you're already not. If you're already not? Yeah. If you're not already. If you're not already. And it's make, oh, you know, here's another thing. Make sure you subscribe to the post notifications in the upper right-hand corner. This is some extra shit. Because they get it right away when you post. Did you know about that? No. Yeah, you didn't know about that? Well, I already knew if you subscribe to someone, it just shows up in your feed. Nah, nah, if you go to my profile, right? And you go to the top right corner, and you oh. click the three buttons. It's like what you do if you're stalking someone. Exactly, turn on the post notifications yeah. so your phone will tell you that I've made a new video. Basically stalk probably. Basically stalk me. 2015. 24-7. Hashtag 2015 for president. Hashtag it's 2016 though. Hashtag Don for president. Hashtag Don for president for sure. He'd be a good president. Anyways, follow my Snapchat as well. I love you guys. I appreciate you guys. I'm out. I hope you liked the video. More to come. Let's go clean this bird shit off my car, man. Go see it. No, <laughs> we're good. Nah, we're good. You're straight, bro. You're good. Nah, nah, nah. Nah, no. Nah, we're good. We're good. We're good.